so Lucy, you, you were saying you, you got this material from so many different places, and was everybody very forthcoming with it? Uh, 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 I guess no. Well, there's a few things we're probably not allowed to talk about because it is we're raising a lot of really important questions about a sport that's big business, and so some of people I think it's, you know, don't necessarily want to shake things up. But for the most part, everyone was amazing. Uh, and uh, what was let interesting? Me just say, let me just say that that ESPN did an interview with Kevin about the movie, yeah. and at the same time, ESPN is also has squelched a, an NFL film about traumatic brain injury. So it's interesting that it almost seems like they've, in, they've al the, the, esta the sports establishment has accepted your movie a little more than the NFL movie and even the military establishment dealing with, they have not been super open about it. Is that maybe because Kevin was such an integral part of that world and he had those relationships, or am I totally wrong? Oh, Kevin is so beloved in the world. And I think also the people involved in the world know uh, the stakes and they are friends with people that are getting hurt and so individually I think people are very um, I think it people have been touched in this world by a lot of injuries and I think people are very sort of personally honest about that um, but am I right that the, this sport to some degree has embraced the story at least more than other sports have I I think in terms of this film, yeah, I think so. I would also salute fair use laws and our wonderful, um, I would have to say, there's a lot that goes into making films and sometimes you really have to work really hard to ask questions. And, and we worked really, really, really hard and we were really diligent and we did everything right and we had lawyers that stood by us and everything uh, has worked out. So what she's saying is to. I'm actually wrong? No. And no. <laughs> I'm just saying it's tough and we had an even sad experience. We were invited to be the first movie to ever screen at the X Games. I was a bit surprised because uh, we weren't sure they hadn't watched it and it's a little bit different there's so many films um, that are either to be brutal about it it's kind of quite sappy recovery movies and they're kind of lovely and moving if you know the person but they're not you know documentaries in our grown-up way uh, and um, or there's loads of what I call ski porn, where you just see trick, 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 and it's all very glamorous, and then they have the crash wheels, you know, the crashes, but you don't really understand, like, how much that hurt or what the kind of ripple effects are. But this was not th that kind of movie, and I don't think people realize that. So it was a bit of a surprise, I think. But it was very sad, and we played at the X Games, and then this poor snowmobiler was killed. And um, it, I had this horrific feeling. when We were, we were very wary, I and mean, it was very hard to stomach when we made... The, that's those sequences. And um, we just wanted to make sure that people understood the stakes and how lucky Kevin is to be here today. But the story needn't have worked out so beautifully and we are so happy that it did.